two squares in a regular hexagon. This is daily math and here we have a geometry problem. We want to find the pink fraction, the ratio of the pink area to the total area of the hexagon. Give it a try and watch the solution. You can solve this. All right, first of all, let's calculate the size of each angle in a regular hexagon. So six sides minus two times 180 over six. That's the formula. So it will be equal to 120 degrees for each angle. So this is 120. This is a right angle. If you can see that now this is 30 degrees. Same thing for the other side. This is 30 degrees. And that means the one in the middle is 60 degrees. Now, if you draw this segment because of the symmetry, this angle will be 30 degrees. The other one is also 30 and this is a right angle. So let's call the side length A. This is also a tangent of 30 degree angle is one over square root three. Let's call this one B. That's equal to B over A. And that means B is A over square root three. So now we can calculate the pink area. It's equal to two times one half B times A. And that's A squared over square root three. So that's the part one. Now we're gonna find the area of the hexagon. So let's say this is the center. The hexagon is formed of six congruent equilateral triangles. This is one of them. These are 60 degrees, right? And that's why it's an equilateral triangle. So for the hexagon, we have this. Six times the formula for these triangles, square root three over four times side squared, that's a squared. And that's three square root three over two times a squared. Now we can have the pink fraction. It's the pink area a squared over square root three over the area of the hexagon, three square root three over two times a squared. A squared cancels out a squared. And this will be two over three square root three times square root three. And that's two over nine. That's the answer. Did you manage to solve it? Tell me in the comments, please. Thanks for watching. See all my friends in the next video. Till then, take care. Goodbye.